first thing you do is you remove the wiper fluid container. And there's a bracket that we supply with the kit. So first thing you'll have to do is you'll have to remove the top bolt from the mount where you usually uh, would mount your uh, power steering pump um, and the bottom bolt here as well. Um, supercharger mount will mount to those bolt holes. So the other ones you can just leave in. Next what you'll do is you'll slide the mount in. Normally you have to go around the, the exhaust manifold. It's a bit more difficult but it fits. So just lower it in place. I'll grab the bolts. Next you're going to tighten those bolts on the bottom. Again, once the manifold's on, it's hard to see, but it's doable. Uh, next thing we'll do is we'll put the belt on. So you have to drop the tensioner that's on the uh, bracket. So if you don't have uh, power steering or uh, air conditioning, you'll have a free section on the front of the crankshaft pulley. That's where the belt for the supercharger will go. slide it down put it around the crankshaft first I'll take it around the tensioner for now and I'll put it on the supercharger first intake hose you'll have to slide it through here just tighten the hose clamp so put the air filter on it Okay, so after you mount the air filter, um, we'll have to uh, replace uh, some hoses here. Normally there's a hose going from your uh, crankcase ventilation back to the intake. Um, we'll put a little adapter on it. Um, so the crankcase breather is just going to go to a separate air filter. You're going to slide it on here and 
the one-way valve on the other port. It's just the original one. Just stick in through the rubber. And tighten it down with the hose clamps. Okay, so breather hose just goes down here. Use some tie wraps to mount. Supply one with a supercharger system. Make sure the arrow is facing towards the intake manifold so it can suck in the air. So I'll just push it over this end. Tighten all the hose clamps down. So the reason we put an adapter here is because we need a port for our blow off valve. Um, you could add another one if you want to keep this original. Uh, for simplicity we just did it this way. Added bonus is that the car won't be sucking in all the oil fumes from the crankcase breather. So next step, final step would be to mount the boost pipe. So we'll slide it over here first. And then do the same with the throttle body side. Then we attach the vacuum hose to the port on the intake manifold. Tighten down the last two hose clamps. That's the installation of the supercharger system done.